We began our little five-mile walk from Lewis, heading off the Ofram Road up to the old race course, past the stables, and then up to Mount Harry, then on to Black Cap. We turned left onto the South Downs Way for a little bit, and then left again, down a valley, over a stile, up through the woods, and then continued on a diagonal across a field, joining up again with the trail above the stables. It was a nice little five-mile loop. Here's a view looking down past the stables and into Lewis. Gorse is now in full bloom, scattered beautifully around. Color is so bright and rich. We passed a field of good-looking cows. Fortunately for me, they were on the other side of the fence. Cows make me nervous. But this one had a lovely face. Much to our delight, we happened upon a farmer and his crew about to begin shearing their sheep. The farmer, Jeremy West of Balmer Farm, had hired in a team of New Zealanders to do the shearing. When they were ready to go, they just turned on the music and went to it. Ah, oh, we play some sheep shearing music. I love this. Bob Wire doing it. Other walkers stopped to watch the fun. We were all filming. Probably calms them down. Maybe off that one. Yeah. The other one seems to be enjoying them. So. Did you say something on New Zealanders? I think so. That boat looks a bit on the left there, maybe in Maori or something. Oh yeah, it could be. Could be, yeah. I know lots of Aussies come over and right. work on farms. They play rugby over at Stenning and there's four or five New Zealanders come over for a couple of years. It's Stenning? Yeah, yeah. They, used to, they used to come and work on the farms for a year or two. Are there some young ones? Yeah, I mean, there's some in that pen. The 
was the perfect surprise element to make our walk memorable. Do you need more than one person to the room?